What day is it? What day is it? Vlogmas day seven and eight. Oh wow, another package. Impressions vanity. They're spoiling me. I just don't know how to. Heck, I'm. A, ooh, it's heavy. I can't. What? Here early this morning. Lord Jesus. In and out. In and out we go. Biscuits in the oven. Hi, it's a pedicure. Hey guys, it's Missy Lynn, and welcome back to another vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed my new intro. I came to get a pedicure because y'all, if y'all see my feet right now, y'all be like, yo, miss, I don't, I don't even mess with you no more. I don't even know how I allow my gel polish to outgrow the way that it did. However, comma. I'm like, I can't keep walking around like this. I'm walking around like a dirt foot. I can't. Oh, I also wanted to say that Vlogmas 7 and 8 are together because after filming that intro, y'all, like, I was so tired that I got in bed and I couldn't even sleep. So I was just editing and editing and editing to the point to where I literally had insomnia just trying to edit for the intro. And then by the time I did fall asleep, it was like 3, 4 o'clock p.m. the next day. Because I had over like a hundred something clips like Wendell took a great amount of uh, clips for me and then I turned around and I found some stuff on my own and then I merged them together so having to sit there and like sort through all of the clips and then figure out which ones I wanted to include which ones I didn't want to include how to make them mesh well together like it was a task at hand but I got it done whoa this weekend is the holiday party I have friends coming in on Thursday and Friday. I don't know what it was, but I felt like between last year and this year, it was like the season to like reconnect and not that like I fell off with anybody, but I moved away. Like my friend Chelsea and Aaron who live in South Carolina, well, Aaron lives in North Carolina now, but I met them um, in South Carolina while I was in the military. I ended up moving away and going to California and so, you know, I still kept in touch with them. I would still fly down to like see them here and there. But I feel like this past year has been like, yo, what are we doing? Like, why are we spending so much time apart? Like, why are we letting a year, two years, five years go by without seeing one another? Like, no, let's not do it. Oh, this is heaven. I'm getting the massage. Heaven, I don't fell asleep and everything. All right, guys, so I know I told you that the uh, vanity was going to be built this weekend, or by the weekend, but I was not expecting all of this, and I actually feel pretty bad. Is it a lot of hassle? Sorry. This, this is like kind of reminding me of Ikea a little bit. Like the styrofoam thing is everywhere. Isn't it funny? Isn't it funny? I thought I won you over. Isn't it funny? Isn't it funny? I thought I won you over. Isn't it funny? Isn't it funny? I thought I won you over. Isn't it funny? Why is this one not working? 
There we go. Sorry guys, my area is a mess with trying to build and having to move stuff out of the the way. So basically, I have the Slay Station 5.0 with the five drawer set. And then um, I have the Hollywood Pro mirror. And it has Bluetooth. It has a dimmer on the side. I can choose, you know, if I want to like turn it off, turn it on, make it super bright. And then that's not even the brightest. You can even go higher, but that's just like too bright. Now I'm going to have to switch this whole filming setup around. Now that I have the vanity in here. I think it makes more sense to be in here. Yeah, I think it does. Okay, so right now I'm just adjusting the time and the date. No. Okay, yep, yeah, time is set. The temperature is normal. Uh, what else, what else? Bluetooth. Let's check that out. This is how loud it is with just my phone. As you can see, the volume's not even all the way up and it's still pretty loud. Okay, now let's see how loud it can actually get. Yeah, that's pretty loud. Oh, you can change the songs on here too? Shoot! So whenever you wanna lower the volume, you hit volume, then you lower it. And then on this side, there's two USB ports and then two outlets. So if I want to like curl my hair or I don't know, charge my camera battery or something, I don't have to like leave my station. I can literally plug it in here. I can plug my phone up here if I want to. I can do all kinds of stuff. <laughs> so it's a pretty cool setup. Now I have to like rearrange. Alright, so now it's time to start brainstorming on how I would like everything set up. I moved all of my lighting equipment out of the way, stored in the closet. I have, still have my ring light out. Um, I moved the desk against the wall. So this is the mini desk that I would use to film in front of this backdrop here. This backdrop stand is going into the garage for now because the Christmas party is on Saturday and I ordered a really pretty backdrop. So. The photo op area will be in the garage this year, so this will be moved out of the way soon. Um, I have a chandelier that I have to get put up in here. I bought it like, I think when I first moved in and the painters never put it up. And then I honestly forgot about it, so yeah. I do feel like now since I have this vanity set up and the lights are super bright, it's really no need to have all of my um, umbrella lights out. So I'm just going to kind of test the scenery, kind of see like what the lighting options are. Just kind of having the ring light and then maybe two of my other lights for whenever I do choose to record. Now I am thinking about moving my makeup drawers in here um, and kind of let this be the filming makeup room. This makes the most sense. The only reason why I didn't even want the vanity in here was because um, I typically get ready during the day in my bathroom. Now I do feel like if I was to sit at my vanity to record a video, I would have some nice back lighting if I was face this direction. And then with the ring light, I could um, have my camera set up in between the ring light. And I think that would be the perfect amount of light. However, just in case I did leave out my umbrella, this is what I use for my overhead lighting, um, just to kind of see. So I'm gonna test it out a little bit later but I have so many different ideas running through my head right now. The thing is, if I was to film my YouTube tutorials here, I wouldn't have anywhere to actually place the camera. It would have to sit on the actual uh, table. It would have to be like back here, you know, and then maybe do some cute like wall decor and stuff right here. The window kind of plays a part in this area. You can't really see, but I have a tall one and then a short one right here. 
So I do want to get some nice drapes and just make it more of like the glam-esque feel. Um, I was thinking about maybe mounting a rod here for my backdrops whenever I do feel like using backdrops. And then I could just leave it there. Um, that way I don't have to use the backdrop stand because it's just taking up room. So that is an option because obviously I'm not going to go into the closet whenever I'm filming. Yeah, um, I'm trying to figure this out right now. What to do, what to do, what to do.